My name is Maticus Brown. I'm a senior. Last year I went to Chile to look at astronomy and the southern hemisphere. The skies in Chile are really, really clear, so it was really cool in terms of astronomy. We got to visit a few different observatories where you could actually look through and see the stars in the different galaxies and clusters and planets. We did interact with a lot of people. We went to the markets and learned about the local area and the plants that were there. I remember one day we got to go see a beekeeper in the Coquimbo region. We got to meet him and his wife and he went and showed us all the beehives they had to like dress up. My name is Justin Symington. I'm the director of global programs at Pacific Ridge School. You know, the world's a small place these days and it's only getting smaller. I love how travel can kind of disrupt our own um, worldviews and our stereotypes and things like that. I'm Nika Majidashad. I'm in 10th grade and I've been here since the 7th grade. I was on the Guangxi route in China, so we actually flew to Shanghai first. That's where I actually got to stay with my homestay family. It was really interesting to see what their family dynamic was like. It was an amazing experience. I personally never thought that as a 14, 15 year old I would be sitting in a completely different country without my parents, just around my peers. It was really interesting to see the way that their education system worked. I call them travel courses because that's what they are and they have been designed from the get-go uh, to be a course of study and it just happens to use a destination as the textbook. We went to Guilin, which was more rural. Um, we went to the rice terraces. Um, and then we also flew to Beijing for the last leg of our trip. Going into the trip, I was a little nervous, but after um, actually getting there and walking around for a little bit, um, I actually became very comfortable really quickly, just because the people, the people there are so kind and so welcoming. Um, and I think it was like a great introduction into my trip and it made me very comfortable. We are trying to have rich, meaningful learning opportunities that can only happen by getting outside of your own comfort zone, which often means getting outside your own culture, getting outside your own geography and your own people, basically, um, your family and your, your own home culture. As ninth graders, going into 10th grade, we're starting to talk about college and the experience of being away from your parents and your families. So I think being independent on that trip and not always being able to talk to my parents was a great experience. Now going into college and going into other school trips, I'm more comfortable being independent.